I am in Washington State, headed towards Porter Creek. It's near Elma and Montesano. It's a natural resource area and requires a pass. The pass is $35. This is a seven day stay and absolutely beautiful. So far driving through here, I've spotted five deer, mostly little ones, a mom, two babies, and then two more babies, yearlings. So I've been here for two days, but there is no reception here. So I had to drive out to be able to um, get on the phone, take care of business, and text everybody. And I'm driving my way back in. It's right off of Highway 12 or 8, um, depending upon which direction you're coming from. It's on the uh, south side of 12. And you can find it in the natural resource area. If you look up uh, natural resource in maps, it will give you all the places that you can stay at for free. And again, seven days free. Beautiful area. The road's not bad. It's gravel, not too bumpy. Couple of graded spots, but not bad grading. It's, it's fairly smooth. Any rig could pretty much come in here. To my left is a gully with the river. Where I'm staying is uh, right on the river. There's a lot of spots that you can stay on the river at. So um, they have tent spots right up here to the left. There it is, the sign, Porter Creek. Camping, bathrooms, fire rings, picnic tables, lots of trails. There is a waterfall trail in here. This is a little bridge I'm going over. This is where the stream goes through. And on the right hand side, is where I am camped at. Normally I would take a ride in here to get to my campsite, but I'm gonna go in further because it looks like this is all the tent area, but there are um, motor homes and areas and such straight ahead. Falls Trail I just passed. The bathrooms here on the right. There's two of them for this little area. It's a tent, tent site camping area. Another entrance to it, to the right. And here we go. I haven't even been down this way. Another tent site. So there's, there's quite a few spots here. Another tent site. I'm following the river right along. It's to the right. Very pretty area. Lots of moss, but very nice and green. So if you need a change of pace from the um, Nevada and Arizona, no greenery, and you decide to come up to Washington State, this is what you're gonna find haven't been to the upper or to the right. I'm going to go ahead and take a right and go in here and see what's going on. Looks like there's a vehicle up ahead. We are still following the river. A couple of vehicles. Where's that one? That's two. Two vehicles up here. Lots of birds. 
They could be up here just fishing. Yeah, it looks like just a pullover spot maybe to go fishing. Ah, little soul. Okay, looky here. There is a trailer. So there's one site. Actually, there's room enough there for probably two. And a trail that goes up. And another bridge. Lots of bridges. Not sure I like going over these bridges much. We'll pick up speed because this is just a regular road. Oh, all kinds of camping here to the left. Wide open. Absolutely wide open. But there's no picnic tables. No fire rings. But there is one fire spot. Where somebody uh, rocked it in. And here we go. Over another bridge. Going back over the creek again. Wow, this goes way back in here. I think when I'm done in here, I will probably uh, turn around. Yep, here's another spot. I mean, just massive camping spots here. This is just crazy that nobody's back here. Maybe the uh, motorhomes don't realize that they can camp in here there certainly is plenty of space for it for sure and it looks like there's some wood here and somebody has been target practicing I'm gonna stop and pick up wood so anyway here we go guys lots of camping here at Porter Creek for seven days for free and I'll talk to you later. Have a wonderful day and a blessed day.